everyone and welcome to this video. So in this video I'm going to show you how to edit the incentive email which goes out when somebody downloads your freebie from within your ConvertKit form. So basically what happens is that they'll put their name and email address into the window that you've created, the form or the sign up form, and then what happens is that they'll receive an email from ConvertKit to ask them to basically approve that that's what they want to do. Now this incentive email goes out automatically from within ConvertKit but it can be personalized. So this is how you find it and how you can actually personalize it. So first of all you need to log into your ConvertKit account. You need to go up here to landing pages and forms. When you do that what you've got is you've got all your forms and your landing pages. So I'm just going to quickly just grab this one. So my five Instagram and Facebook stories form. So this is a page that I've created and I've also created a thank you page for it. But what we want to concentrate on here is this settings area. So up here there's a settings tab, click that and then what we want to do is we want to go to the incentive tab. Now this gives you the opportunity to edit the incentive email. So when you click on edit it's going to allow you to come in here and edit. So important, confirm your subscription so that your download will begin. So already you've personalized the subject line. Instead of it just saying important, confirm your subscription, you've actually said why that is happening. Now underneath here, what happens is that it says, thank you for signing up, click the link below to confirm your subscription and you'll be on your way click your description and it's good to go. What you can do here is you can actually personalize it. So when you click on this button here, you see you've got the plus option. So when you click the plus option, you can then add in anything you wish. So the first thing we want to do is say, hey there. So I go, hey there. I'm gonna put thanks for requesting my Instagram and Facebook stories, visibility tips. Okay, so then what you need to do is please confirm you are happy to download it by clicking the button below. Now I always like to put a little emoji in here, so I'm just going to grab a little emoji. And then I'm going to just get rid of this other bit. And also what I'm going to do is I'm going to make this button my brand colour. So I just clicked on the button. This URL here is automatically set by ConvertKit because that basically means that you're going to confirm. I'm going to change my button colour to match my brand, so I already know what that one is. So it's. Um, E97, so that's my nice pink. I'm also going to change what's written here, so I'm going to put in capitals, click to download, and then all I need to do is sign it off. So I'm going to say, thanks, oops, let's take it off capitals. Thanks so much. See you soon. Anita. And that's all you have to do. So then all you need to do now is click save and that incentive email will be saved for you. Now obviously there are some other things that you need to work out. If you're giving a free download this is where you would put your download file because what will happen is that when they receive that email they'll click that button and they'll automatically be sent to the download. Now this incentive email needs to be changed for every form or landing page that you create. You need to click save and publish. So go ahead and click save and publish. That's super important. You can do this for all of your landing pages so that they've all got different incentive emails if you wish, especially if you have more than one form opting in. So you've got your landing page, they get their incentive, they sign, they click on it, they get their download. And then of course there's other things that you can do once they've signed up for this which we will cover in a future video. So don't forget if you have any questions about editing the incentive email for your ConvertKit freebie 
then please do pop the questions underneath this video and if you've liked this video do give me the thumbs up and if you have any other queries then do feel free to reach out. Don't forget that if you're watching this video on YouTube to subscribe to my channel if you want to learn more about using ConvertKit and growing your business online. Okay, I'll see you soon. Bye for now.